You know, I never got a chance to play Worlds in Syndrome, but I know it's a visual novel game made by Arc System Works. Like, it looks it looks interesting, but I really want to try it. I ain't got no damn money, so you know, can't you know, try it. But uh, the point is, the point is, I really, really have had an idea for the longest time. Arxis should make a Blaze Blue dating sim, and like, it seems kind of. I'm surprised they haven't actually done this yet, mainly because they had the visual novel experience. They they, they pretty much did with X Blaze Worlds and Syndrome. They have a bunch of other visual novels ideas, even Blaze Blue itself. They got a bunch of good visual novel experience to make a Blaze with dating sim. And like they got enough characters to pull it off. Hell, it's you know, instead of just the female characters, you can put the male characters in for the women who want to play with the male characters. Uh hell, you can bring in characters that haven't even been used yet. Like characters like Kajun, Linwa, freaking <laughs> uh throw in uh crap. Okay, what's her face? Uh throw in Trinity. No, no, it wasn't Trinity. Yeah, but yeah, throw in Trinity, but uh Crap, who was it? Throw in, throw in the whole master, <laughs> throw in the whole master unit. <laughs> nah, nah, but but no, seriously though, but no, seriously though. Like, a Blaze Blue dating sim is a is a game idea I've been wanting for the longest time though. Like screw the screw mobile games, screw um, Dead Spike Son though that game is pretty fun. Uh, screw all the freaking uh of uh, those little chibi games like Clone Phantasma for like 3DS and crap like that. Don't, forget all those. A Blaze Blue dating sim is a good idea, and I swear I'm surprised Arxis has not pulled that off yet. Hell, do like a collaboration with like other like with other, other characters. Like, you know, maybe they have like a secret episode where Guilty Gear characters get introduced. Like, it doesn't have to be just Blaze Blue dating sim, but I want one. Like, you got enough female characters. You get about what? Okay, so the then the roster at this point in Blaze Blue is about 36 characters. You have 18 males and 18 females. That's a perfect perfect cut, perfect balance for a good dating sim. You know, I mean, granted, you probably won't be using all the characters in the day, so I'm not asking for all the characters. Just put, like, a select few female characters in there. Like, put the ones everybody recognizes, like Noelle, Rachel, um, uh, Coca, No Way. I don't know. Pick, 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 pick characters that people recognize. Don't put Esso. Like, that's a, compli that's a complicated thing. No, you can't put S in there. Just put all, like, put just every female character and see what happens. I don't know. Just make it about the female characters. Just don't put, just make it about the male characters. That's gonna make me sad. <laughs> but yeah, just make a blaze. I want. I've always wanted a blazable dating sim. I don't know why, but I like. I feel as though because I've seen how blazable works as a visual novel and it works pretty fine as one. Like they only had to do it with the fighting game part. They got half. They already have half the work done for them. <laughs> like there's no fighting game aspect to put through it, so they already got the uh, work done for it. They already did like um, the whole good ending and bad ending kind of thing in Blaze before, so they can just do with that. Make make it crazy. The girls already are already super powerful. Shoot, just <laughs> just freaking make them blow your brains out when they freaking um when they when you get a bad ending or some crap like that. Like if Noel got a bad ending, you know, make her go all crazy and you know shoot shoot your face off with the bulwark. I don't know anything. Cause like it, it, it seems like a good idea to have a Blaze Blue dating sim. I I I've never made a I've never made a visual novel myself before. Though I used to make Blaze Blue skits, and you could technically count those as visual novels. If eh, eh, no, nah, I don't know. Like you can technically count those as visual novels. I don't have visual novel experience myself. I play a lot of them, but as for making one, I could not, dude. I, I couldn't even be bothered to make one. I attempted to make one back in middle school, but it was so damn hard. And all the characters are poorly poorly written, so I didn't even bother. <laughs> um, but I, I've always wanted a Blaze Blue dating sim. Hell, if Sinron Kagura can technically do it, why can't Blaze Blue? And I'm not, I'm not trying to compare Sinron Kagura to Blaze Blue. They are two, two two different things. But like, I see like it works. I mean, hell, I mean, if you were to break it down, freaking uh, uh, Persona has some uh, li um, some sim like um, some life. Like simulators aspects to it, which you know, obviously, you know, you go to school, you take jobs, etc., etc. You can do a day sim with Blaze Blue. It's not like they got experience; they've done it before. <laughs> um, but I don't even know. Like, I, I would like I don't want to do all eighteen girls because like that would be a little bit too much. Like all well, all eighteen playable female characters, and um, it seems like a bit, a bit excessive to have that many female characters. So it's like, it's like I dumb it down. To characters like let's okay, as I said important, Rachel, Noel. I said Coco No Way, but I'm trying to like hit a demographic, hit everyone because like 
I would just like limit myself to the fir- main, the first uh, female characters introduced to Blazable, which would be Noel, Rachel, Lychee, uh New, uh, and Tao. Uh, damn, I'm missing one more character. Wait, wait, Rachel. Wait, Noel, Rachel, Lychee, New, Tao. Did my brain just flatline for a moment? <laughs> I forgot that. The point, that's, not, that's not the point. That's the point. I'm, I'm going to be thinking about this all day. I, I can't believe it. I forgot Blaze will care. How the hell? I know it's right there, but I, I, I don't have time for that. The point is, Blaze will date some. They could capitalize off that crap, man. You know how much money that would make Arxis? Well, not a whole lot, but it would make a good amount of money. Like, hell, make a Guilty Gear dating sim. I mean, actually, you know what? No, no, make a Guilty Gear dating sim. That'd be a great idea. I've always wanted to date Biking. I mean, I mean, well, I mean, yeah, but I mean, Melia, no, Melia would be a great, great representation for the boys. Uh, no, uh, Guilty Gear dating sim. Melia would be great. Kinda. I mean, I don't think Melia would be all that great, though. I'm not, I'm not gonna lie. I kind of over exaggerate that one a bit. <laughs> um, but yeah, like. Like, you can exclude some characters. Like, characters like Subaki. I mean, you could put in um, Subaki for the Blaze Blue um, dating sim side. I feel like she'd be an okay character for it. You know, considering how, you know, well, normal she is as a character when you think about it. Um, we could take characters like Platinum out. That's... Not even getting to that. You could keep Trinity, though. You could keep Trinity. Or you, you could put Platinum in, but not make it like a dating sim. And more like, make, more, make it more like a... Um, like when you like um you just hang out with the character and know more about them. Not like the whole dating aspect, that's just creepy. Uh, but you you can work it with platinum, but just don't make it like actually dating wise. Just make it like more like a hanging out with platinum. She bonds with you, you get closer, boom, you become friends with platinum. Friends with platinum, not dating platinum, friends. Okay. Friends with platinum ain't that bad. Although it's gonna be like it's like it's like it's gonna be like more and more more of the harder uh things to like level up as a, like a bond kind of thing. Cause like platinum's like super well, Lu- well, Luna is super, super, like, offensive to everything. <laughs> um, uh, shoot. And plus, with this way, you can learn more about the characters you didn't learn in the actual series. I mean, of course, the dating will be non-canon, but, you know, make, like, your own player avatar, date with the girl, ex- move on, etc., etc. Like, if... I like that idea. I will, I've been asking for that since 2000, about, what, 2013? I've been asking that for, like, Seven years now, as of this as of this video, it's been seven years since I've been asking for that, and I still haven't got my wish yet. Like, uh, I would love a Blaze Blue Dating Sim. I'm not gonna lie. I'm not gonna lie. As I said before, I got no experience with this, but I just wanted to talk about it because I feel like it would be a good idea. So, I don't know what you guys think. Tell me in the comments and crap like that. What would you like for a Blaze Blue Dating Sim? Uh, give me give me some pointers about this, you know, because I would want to hear what you guys got to say about this. Because I am terrible at coming up with ideas. I suck. At come up with game ideas. I suck. I can write all day long, but for the life of me, game ideas are something that I am garbage at. So, without further ado, I'll see y'all next time. Hope you have a great day. You know, keep up your health. I'll see y'all next time with another video. You know, it's not gonna be a blaze rambling one, but <laughs> we'll know. We'll know. <laughs>